Hey, so today on Tuesday Tip, we want to talk about something that almost every yard has. That slopes. Uh, so we deal with a lot of yards in Middle Georgia that are flat, but we also have a number of yards that have a ditch in the front yard or that have slopes on them. And so we wanted to talk about how to maneuver slopes. A lot of times people say, oh, we, well, you know, you got to weed eat it and those kind of things. And, and in some slopes and some ditches, you do need to, uh, to pay attention to that. One of the things that you always want to pay attention to is your mower. Uh, what kind of mower you have, what kind of grade or slope your mower can be on. If your mower is on too high of a slope or too steep of a slope, you have a pretty good chance of it rolling over. You never want it to roll over because if it rolls over and pins you under it, it could be for a very, very bad day. And so as you're out there mowing your lawns, go side to side with your mower. Um, make sure that you can go up and down in some cases, uh, but when the, when the yard is asleep, you can, you can come along the edge uh, making sure that the mower uh, is pointed in the direction that you need it to throw its debris or discharge in. Uh, the other thing that you want to always do is make sure if you have a roll bar that goes across the back of your mower, you want to make sure while you're cutting a lot of slopes that you have that roll bar up in case there is a situation where you, uh, you roll over or uh, you have that. We also have situations where uh, we mow around people's edges, people's ponds, and things like that. We have a client right out in this area that has a steep embankment down to a lake or down to a pond, and you need to be cautious of that. Try, you know, everybody wants to get just a little bit closer, and I always find that person who wants to get just a little bit closer usually winds up in the pond or in the lake. Uh, and then you have it a situation with your mower being in the lake, which is never a fun thing to deal with either. So. Uh, just be cautious when you're using your mowers on slopes. Make sure you understand how your mower operates and what kind of slope or grade your particular mower can be on. If you have a mower with a small frame, small wheel span, it's really not going to do very well on slopes. If you have one with a little wider wheel span, a little bit farther apart, that's going to give you a little bit more stability uh, on your slopes. and so. I hope these simple tips will help you out while you're out there cutting the grass. If you have any questions or you need some help with your uh, slope or any other landscape project, let us know.